Hey YouTube, it's Lip Bone Queen here. Just want to get on here today and I want to show you my weekend Dollar Tree haul. Um, I went out of town today and um, went and spent some time with my mom and dad. And at my mom and dad's house, there is like a really awesome Dollar Tree around there. So um, I went up there today and got a few things. I want to get in here and I want to show you what I picked up. I know I hadn't done a Dollar Tree haul in a little while, so I wanted to get in here and I wanted to show you what I found. Because for me, it feels like I hit the jackpot because I did find a lot of good things that everybody's been hauling. And I wanted to uh, get on here and I wanted to show you. Um, first of all, I'll start off with um, like some snacks that I picked up. Um, I picked up just some Wise All Natural Potato Chips um, just to have in the house. So I picked up those. Nothing real exciting. Then, um, me and my boys are having movie night tonight. So I picked up some of the uh, Primetime Premium Popcorn and Butter. It's like the light butter. Um, I picked up some of that. And then, um, I seen Susanna, um, she, uh, hauled these. And these things, oh my gosh, these things right here are freaking amazing. I'm trying to get the, uh, package, uh, where I can get one out. These things are so good. These are the, um, English lemon tea cookies from Love You. And these things look like this. And I will eat one on the camera because they're so good. Mmm. They're so good. But she got me already hooked on these things. And um, I wish I had bought more. There's no artificial colors, no cholesterol, and no preservatives. And they're bite size. And um, they're so good. I was going to see if it said anything else. Um, for four cookies, it's 70 calories. And total fat is uh, 4.5 grams. If y'all are interested in that. And they are made in the USA. They are made in Lewis, Louisville, um, Kentucky. If I can talk. Blah. See right there is where it says. Made in the USA. That's where it's made. And there's their website if you need to get on there and uh, check them out. Because these things are amazing. Um... So thank you, Susanna. Those were awesome. I'm absolutely loving them. Okay. Then, um, I seen a Country Chic pick this up. Uh, my friend Anna, she uh, hauled this, and I found one today. I was super excited. It's the Fruit Infuser Tumbler. And, of course, it had to be the color purple because that's my color. I love, I love purple. So I picked up the tumbler, which I'm super excited about because I've been trying to drink more water. And if you can infuse your water to make it to where you can drink it more, go for it. So, I'm, I'm all for that. So then, my friend Roxana, she had uh, hauled these in one of her um, hauls. Or she had posted a picture or something of it on Instagram. And I saw it was like, oh my gosh, I've got to have those. Because my Dollar Tree didn't have them. And when I went out of um, out of town today, I happened to find some. So she's supposed to be sending me some, which I'm super excited about. So definitely send them because uh, these things are amazing. I picked up a bag of the Brock's uh, Sea Salt Caramel um, Swirls. These things are freaking amazing and I love them. And then I picked up another bag. I picked up the Chocolate Caramel. Oh my gosh, these are so good, guys. If you see these at your store, you definitely can pick them up. If you love, any, if you love caramel, definitely pick them up. So I wanted to get in here and wanted to show you that. And then, um, I figured it's good to have this on hand. And I used the last bit up the other day. I had a real bad headache. And I used up the last of my, um, my Assured Extra Strength Pain Relief. It's, uh, compared to the Extra Strength Tylenol Rapid Release Gels. Um, so I definitely picked up another one of those. Because these, these work just as good as the Tylenol brand. So definitely pick these up if you don't want to pay full price, but you want one that works. This definitely does work. It's really good. Because I get some really bad headaches sometimes, and that's like the only thing that kicks it. So I picked up some more of those. Then um, I picked up some of the Two Bar um, Dial Lavender and, ja and Twilight Jasmine. This stuff smells amazing. I don't have this at my Dollar Tree. I've been looking for it. I think the last time I got it was when I was at my mom and dad's house when I went up to Dollar Tree. Um, but these these smell so good. Oh my gosh, they're so good. And uh, it's a two pack for a dollar, so it was a really good buy. So I'm super excited about that. And then um, I found the uh, Band Aid brand Band Aids, and these are the Mickey Mouse ones. Um, they're sheer strips, double bonus. You get ten extra. Um, 
So all together, you get 50 bandages. So I thought it was a really good deal getting that for a dollar for 50 bandages and the Band-Aid brand, which is even better. And that's what they look like. Look. I love that little Mickey Mouse. I love that. So I was super excited about that. The five extra that are in there are the Mickey Mouse. So I thought that was super cute. So um, pick that up. And then I went down to Candy Owl because um, my, uh, my boys absolutely just love any kind of candy. And I try not to give them a whole lot. But when I saw this, I thought this would be fun for them. I thought they'd really like that. This right here is the... Uh, they're Crayola Licked to Reveal the Mystery Color. Color Your Tongue Mystery Licks. And they're almost like them sweet tart, like, um, kind of suckers. And, uh, they're like a mystery lick. So I picked up a bag of those for them. You get nine in a pack. And then I picked up the uh, Color Your Mouth Pops from Crayola. It says Color Your Tongue While You Lick. And they're the, uh, the Crayola suckers. They look like that. And then I picked them up the uh, Crayola plastic straws with candy powder inside. And they're supposed to color your tongue. So I picked them up some of those because I know they love stuff like that. So I picked them up. And then I happened to run by and see these. And I have not seen these for like forever now because I've been trying to find them. And these are the uh, Hachu, uh, my favorite candy from Dollar Tree right now. Um, tropical mix. This is the mango, banana, and melon fruit chews. I was hoping to find the other bag, the yellow bag, because it has like the grape, the apple, and the strawberry. And I absolutely love the strawberry and I love the grape. But when I seen these, I was like, oh gosh. So I grabbed a bag. I should have grabbed more, but I just grabbed one. I was trying to be good. And um, I absolutely love these. So I'm so glad I found another bag. And then the last thing that I picked up food-wise was I picked up a bag of these Granny's, Granny's Oven Brownie Crisp Cookies. Oh my gosh. These with a cup of coffee are amazing. And I absolutely love these. And so does my family. So I picked up a bag of these. Um, I was super excited to finally found them again. And of course it's a different Dollar Tree that I don't normally go to. So my Dollar Tree doesn't carry them anymore. So I definitely made sure to pick them up. Then I picked up this basket to do a little organizing in my room. Um, it's a purple one with the real pretty... Um, like design right there. I think that's so pretty. And I love purple. And it's a really good size, like roomy like basket. So I figured I could use this um, to organize in my room a little bit. So I picked that up. And then um, I found this. This was just randomly sitting around in Dollar Tree. I don't know where the section it would be. I looked in the craft section and everything else. And the uh, stationary section didn't find it. And this was just sitting randomly. It's the Scotch Expressions washi tape. I've been trying to find this stuff anyways. I've seen people haul it. And I hadn't been able to find it. And then just randomly today, I found the alphabet one. It was only one. And I picked it up because I figured this would be good for me to have my, my washi tape collection. Because I have not been able to find them. And so I picked up one today. And I was super excited to find it finally. So I picked that up. And then I went down the makeup aisle. And um, I was like, okay, looking around. And then I thought, no, no. I've got to, I've got to go down to the... Um, to the aisle where it's got the, the body sprays and stuff because I was looking for the two new um, uh, body sprays and I found them. I was so excited. It's the Intimate Tropical Mango and Hibiscus um, body spray and you get an 8.4 fluid ounce. This is a hydrating uh, body mist and this stuff smells amazing. Oh my gosh. I don't know which one I like better. God, it smells so good. And for some reason, like before, these didn't last really well. Like the love one supposed to be compared to Love Spell and the one that's supposed to be compared to uh, Pure Seduction. They didn't last long on me when I sprayed them. But today, I sprayed uh, this one right here and it really did last a long time on me. So I don't know if they've changed the formula or what. But um, then, then I also picked up the Coconut Hibiscus. It smells amazing also. It reminds me of like the beach and stuff. Like the um, tropical like sunscreen and stuff. It smells so good. So I picked up both of those. I'm so glad I found them finally. I've seen everybody haul them and I was like, oh my gosh, I hope I find them because I love me some fruity like smelling uh, body sprays and stuff. So I picked those up. And then the last things I picked up, which I was so excited, I finally found. I've actually been looking for these for a couple days now. Um, or weeks now, technically. Um, I picked up the uh, LA Color Color Bombs. And uh, I wanted to get here. I wanted to swatch them for y'all. I know a lot of people have been swatching them, but I wanted to get on here and I wanted to do it myself because, 
like I said, I wanted my own opinion on these, like I do every lip balm. And these are supposed to be a tinted lip balm. And I'm just super excited. I finally found them. And I will swatch each one for y'all. Because I always do that for y'all. If my camera won't shut off on me. My camera's acting up today. Okay. So I picked up all six. Right here. These are the color bombs. And the first one that I'm going to um, show you is the color Wham. I actually have it on my lips today. It's a real pretty, like, um, orange color. Looks like this. And I will swatch it on my hand for y'all. That's a beautiful, beautiful color. And I love it on my lips, too. I don't normally go towards, like, the orange colors, but I wanted to get each one of these so I could swatch them for you. And, um, of course, I want them in my collection because they're just awesome. And the one I have on my lip I've been wearing for a little while, and it's really moisturizing, and I really enjoy it. I'm actually really loving these. And um, this one here is called Boom. And I love the packaging, too. And I will swatch that for y'all. This is more of a light, a light red, like, um, yeah, and I think it's really pretty, though. I like that color. And none of these smell. Everybody's been, you know, that's been hauling them has been like, been like, do they smell? Do they smell? No, they don't. And I like that. I keep sniffing it because I, I just keep thinking there's going to be a smell to it. But <laughs> anyways, this one's called Kapow. It's a real pretty purple. This is the packaging. And I will swatch it for y'all too. And it is, it's kind of like a reddish, almost like a, a violet color a little bit, but it's real light. It's almost like a reddish color. It's like so light. But I really do love that color. And then, um, this one here, this was like, I found this one first. This was my very first one I had saw. And, um, I really did like this one too. This one's called Zap. And there's the color. And it's a real pretty, like, pink. Let's see if I can. And you can build these colors up on this. If you keep swatching, you will get, like, a really pretty, uh, pretty color if you keep building it up. But this one right here is, um, the pink one I was just showing you. So then, the last two, um... This one is called Smooch in the white packaging, which I love the pink and white packaging like that. It's pretty. And I will swatch it for you. This one's like a true baby pink, and I really love it. This one right here. I'll get my finger on it. There you go. It's a real pretty baby pink. And then this one's called Swoon. And it's like a real nude, like white looking color, like a beige -ish color. And this one goes on a white color, like a like almost a clearish, like nude, like sheer color. Um, so these are all the colors of the color bombs, and these are amazing lip balms. I'm so excited to have these in my collection. And um, you know, if I found them, I had to I had to haul them for y'all and swatch them for you guys. And none of them are scented. They are unscented, so if you're the type that really like unscented lip balms, but you like tinted lip balms that are moisturizing, these are definitely ones you need to go after. These are the colors, and they are all very beautiful in their own way, and I absolutely love the colors. And I'm super excited to find them, and for a dollar piece, I think that was a great buy, so I am definitely excited to have these in my collection. And um that completes my haul i just want to get on here and i wanted to show you the dollar tree stuff that i found today and the new dollar tree like the different one that i don't normally go to so i hope y'all have a blessed day and um i hope um you also um if you're looking for things at your dollar tree i hope that you can find them and uh remember just look around go to different dollar trees if you can't find certain items and and hope that you find it because i know it's aggravating when you're looking for something and you can't find it and I also have left two things out of this haul before I get off here. Um, my friend Deb Anderson, as y'all all probably know her already, um, she has been looking for the Studio C um, ID pouch. Um, and I have not been able to find them until today. There was two on the shelf, 
and I didn't know how many that she was wanting so I just grabbed the two that were there and these are the black uh, like pleather um, ID badges um, pouches so I picked them up for her. they're from Studio C and I picked them up for her because I knew she'd been looking for some kind of like ID pouch and I was like this got to be it so I picked them up and these are really good um, quality um, but I wasn't sure how many she needed so I picked her up two of them so um, Deb, you have two ID pouches. Um, but I just want to get here and I want to show you this real quick and I hope y'all have a blessed day and a wonderful weekend. And to all the fathers out there, if there's any on here watching me, I hope y'all have a wonderful Father's Day. And, um, and ladies, definitely treat your men good for Father's Day. And, um, I will talk to you guys next time. I hope you have a blessed day. Thanks. Bye.